Alright, hello everyone. So just a quick video talking about changing the differential bushings on the RX-7. Uh, by far this is the most difficult job I've had to do. So this is the diff out of the uh, RX-7 and the bushings, there's two of them, one on each side of the diff and these are the bushings that uh, connect the diff to the uh, to the car, to the subframe of the car. So you know they're probably worn out you might want to change them while you're doing this job anyway this is a very difficult job it took me two days to get these out um, and only after I found the official way of doing it in the, in the factory manual that really it helped me so the first step is to uh, drill out the rubber so the way these bushings are there's a uh, solid metal piece in the middle which where the bolt goes or goes, and then there's uh, rubber all the way around. So you got to drill all the way around. You can see how much rubber come up, came out. There's some large pieces over there. Get all the rubber out, and then you, there's a metal ring around the outside. And uh, I'll actually, you know, I'll get the new one. I'll show you what it looks like. So this is a brand new one. And so you can see there's a metal uh, sort of bar in the middle for the bolt. There's rubber on the outside, and there's this metal outer frame. And this frame, this, this metal outer part, actually squeezes together when you install it. And so it's in there really tight. And if you haven't changed this in 30 years, these things are super hard to get out. So essentially, you've got to drill out all this rubber, and then you've got to bend the lip of this metal piece here forwards, upwards, using a hammer. So you can see the hammer in the corner there and a chisel and it still won't come out. So what, you, what I had to do is get my, uh, my um, Makita um, dr or Dremel here, electrical Dremel, and start grinding it away and finally it'll come apart in two pieces. So this is one, you can see how much I had to bash it in and Dremel it away. This is the inner part, here's the other one, half, half. So two days of work to get this up. Uh, the, the propane torch over there didn't really help very much. Uh, so be aware when you're doing this job that it will take quite a bit of effort. And you need, you're need you gonna need the right tools. So you need a drill. I needed a electrical Dremel there. And you definitely need a big hammer and a set of chisels. So now that we've got that out of the way, you can install the new one. This is the factory bushing. So the, it's a uh, press fit. You got to hammer it in. Now the factory says you got to press it in with a, you know, a proper shop press. I don't have one of those, but I'm going with the other type of uh, bushing, which is a solid Delrin bushing. This one's made from Black Path, and uh, they're about 50 bucks. And so these will just be a press fit, and this is supposed to improve your uh, your response. So there you go, changing the bushings for the diff. Hardest job I've done yet, but uh, stay tuned for more.